All right, so this is a very short video I want to make to address a request made by one of my friends on my YouTube channel. All right, so he said, this is great say. Please also help with a video on how to know the right size of the contactor for a specific load. All right, so knowing the contactor size to use for a particular load is very important because basically the contactor serves as a switch to whatever load you are connecting it to. And so the contactor must be designed to be able to withstand the total amount of current that is required by the load. All right, so the question is, how will I know if this contactor will be able to carry the current that will be going to the load or the loads? Very simple. Just as any electrical device is labeled with either the amount of power and voltage or the amount of current that that device can safely carry, the amount of current that a contactor can safely withstand is also stated on it. And you can properly decide the size of your contactor after knowing the size of your load. All right, so after knowing the amount of current that your load or your loads will need to weigh, then you will have to select an appropriate size of contactor to connect to those loads. All right, so if you get a contactor, usually the labeling is either on the side of the contactor or sometimes at the top. And so the information you need to know about this contactor is all on this label. All right, so we are talking about current. So you can see that this contactor is actually rated 40 amps. It means it can withstand up to 40 amps. And you have several information that can help you to appropriately select one for your needs. All right, so when you come here, you can see that here, if you are using it on 230 volts, you can connect a load up to 7,500 watts. That is 7.5 kilowatts. And if you are using it on a 380 or 400 volts, you can connect a load up to 15 kilowatts. And so that is the simplest way to find out the capacity of the contactor you are getting for your load. All right, so I trust you have learned something meaningful from this short video. Thank you very much for watching this video. Kindly like, share, and subscribe to stay connected. Thank you very much again. See you in my next video.